In this class, we are going to learn how to remove duplicate values from the data in your Visual Builder application when displaying in a page. Here for this demonstration, I am considering this page which we have created in our previous classes. Here if you see the data in each row, we are having couple of records with the office number. Now suppose if we are interested in only getting only one number for office instead of two, how to remove the duplicate value we will see in this class. So in order to achieve the use case, we assume that you will be getting the data from some source like from business object, database or from web service. So basically you will store that value in an ADP or some array So and the array will look something like this. In order to demonstrate this use case in a simple way, I have copy pasted this sample array data into a JavaScript code where I will be writing the expression that is to remove the duplicates. Now here if you are getting this data or an array in some variable then you have to just pass that ADP value over here in the agreement while we call this function. You have to basically call this function in the VB enter or any other event with the help of which you are populating that table. Now let's go ahead with the use case. Suppose I am considering this as my data in which I am having couple of records for office. Now what I have to do is I have to restrict the data over here and remove the duplicate values that is I want to get only one record with office. Now here I will tell unique records I will create one variable. Now I will make use of this data data and I will make use of this filter function. Here I will create two arguments one is an object with the help of which we can get the object details and the index to know where we have iterated. Then what I will do is I will return by checking whether index is equal to equal to equal to data and I will make use of another expression over here or the function that is find index where I will make use of one object over here with the name O and I will check object dot phone type if it is equal to equal to equal to O dot phone type. Here basically what I am comparing is first I am filtering the data and finding the index and then I am comparing with the same data and finding whether that particular value is present in any other fields. If it is then I am just returning the index. Here when I am passing this data I have to pass the unique records. Let me now switch over to the page designer and see whether we are getting a couple of office numbers or only one. Now here when the data gets loaded we are seeing only one office number so like this we can remove the duplicate records in our visual builder application that is by making use of javascript function something like this.